video will only focus on this metallic blue cat suit from Bright and Shiny. And I'm going to try it on. It's a neck entry, it has no zipper in the back or the front. That's going to be interesting. <laughs> Bright and Shiny is the Ukrainian brand who sent this to me and I can't wait to get into it because I think the color looks really cool once I'm wearing it. So check it out. It took me a little while because, you know, neck entry catsuit is never something to get into really fast because you have to squeeze through this opening here the whole body. Luckily 0.25mm latex gorge is really stretchy, so I managed and what can I say, I'm blown away by this cut. I mean, it's called anatomic cut catsuit and it's completely made to measure and I think you can see that because it just... It just fits so good. <laughs> I'm amazed by the fit. Enough with admiring the cut simply without saying something. I'm going to tell you a few facts. It is a thong pandy cut here. So we have the seams here and also in the back that leave the optical impression of a thong. So it's not just a average catsuit cut but something special. <laughs> I chose the following configurations. Made to measure of course 0.25mm gorge, fingerless gloves, stirrups and the cups here and no zippers. So neither in the crotch nor in the back nor in the front. Why no zippers? Because it just is a really different and snug fit without zippers. So you have nothing that yeah, disrupts the material with a different structure and also you can try and squeeze out the air and just, yeah, <laughs> try to squeeze out of the neck or the legs so it sits really, although I hate this expression, like a second skin. <laughs> I love the fingerless gloves and the stirrups as well because I ensure that <laughs> the legs and arms are long enough <laughs> with this option and I also think that it's a cool look to have these thumb holes and it just looks instantly more cozy <laughs> with the thumb holes and also with the stirrups the legs can ride up so it's not going to look too short and will always stay in place. And last but not least the cups. <laughs> I think they really enhance the whole fit and the whole yeah, figure it makes visually. Also when I move to the side you can really see that my boobs are not pressed flat but they have enough space and they look really good in this catsuit. So I love that option. Also you can again try to press out the air around the boobs that it is going to fit even better. I did not style it up yet, so you could see the catsuit as it is, but it's time to gear up and do proper fetish styling. I simply put my Swedish collar on top, I mean the collar and the cuffs, so now it's going to be really loud. <laughs> but I think that it is not too, too much, so to say, because the Swedish collars are black with a bit of silver, so it's really toned down and it fits the overall look. I paired it with some black heels. And of course have black fingernails and toenails, so that adds to the look as well. And I think that is a really cool fetish look that is not too aggressive, <laughs> so to say. And I really like it. Back to Bright and Shiny, who made the suit. Um, they're from Ukraine. And they just launched a new homepage, so you should check it out. I have a discount code as well. I'll link it, of course. And Bright and Shiny does not only do latex, but they also have spandex items, so have a look at their shop. By the way, I also do have a bodysuit from Bright and Shiny. I can show you a few pictures. It is a metallic pewter and also 0.25mm. And yeah, I think the pictures here from the City Harbour are really great still after all these years. One last thing I want to try out is adding this belt for the waist. Let's see if it matches. The look. <laughs> okay, obviously this one screams fetish in your face now with the belt. It's up to you. What do you prefer, with or without belt or without Swedish color even? Leave a comment down below. Also, I have to thank Bright and Shiny for sending me this catsuit and for this cooperation. I really enjoyed it and I really enjoyed this catsuit. <laughs> 
so thanks. <laughs> Does any one of you have a neck entry cat suit and do you have some really cool tips to get into? If so, leave it in the comments. My tip is just a lot of oil helps a lot. <laughs> and with that, I'm done here for today. I hope you're having a nice time. See you in the next video. Bye.